So this is Seven Days to Die, a zombie survival game where there's a horde that comes and tries to unalive you every seven days. Well, that's normally the case, but I have a horde night set for every single night. So I have also sent some ground rules for myself. I can't go into POIs unless I have a quest to do so, and I can't stay in those POIs during horde night. So that essentially means that I have to build my own base and try to survive. So, my game's difficulty is Adventurer, which is default, my XP modifier is 150, and my day length is 60 minutes, which is also default. Now, the first thing we need to do is finish these quests and head to the trader, and once we're at the trader, we will decide what our next move is. So, and of course, it's almost, um, it's over a mile away. That's just great. That's great. What type of trader? Who is this? Is this the farming guy? I don't like being in the desert. Yeah, trader wrecked. Yeah, I know I kept that open, but I don't really care. Uh, nah, we're gonna do clear zombies. Alright, so we can actually go on this building. So, the reason why I want to do a trader quest right away is so that I can potentially get something that would help me out during Horde Night. Some XP and some dukes to buy some basic supplies. Now, like, outside and stuff, like, if there's cars in, like, someone's front yard, I, I'll be able to search that, but I can't go inside the building. Now, I did realize I kind of, uh, exploited the game there, because, yep, these should be... Hello, zombies. Goodbye, zombies. I somehow... <laughs> power attacked your head off with a blunt club. That was, uh... Pretty cool. Yep, there he is. Stop. 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 Alright. Cool ammo. We might be able to use that tonight. I don't know. Alright. Uh, sure. I'm sure that's very helpful. No, zombie. Stop it. Thank you, zombie. Alright, we got some of that stuff. We're gonna get some food here. We'll take these chairs so we can scrap them. Easy wood. I hear a zombie. I don't know where. Hello, zombie. Bye bye, zombie. Did I? <laughs> I shot his head off, dude. <laughs> did I? No. I thought I did. I did. Oh, man. Yeah, we'll take that, I guess. Um, it's almost, it's already almost 12, and I haven't even begun making my base. Alright. That is great, that is great. Uh, we'll do this. I hear it. I heard a zombie. 15. Yep, yeah, that is good. Stop it, zombie. Okay, we are done with this place when it comes to killing the zombies, doing the quest. Now, it's already past 12, so I have to hurry back and build up a base uh, that is capable of of surviving a horde attack. Alrighty, so we are back. We are back here. Hopefully, I don't think he's not going to give us anything good, but the XP is what I'm really wanting. Can I... You're not Again. bringing counterfeit money in here, are you? Oh, that's perfect. The wood. Yes. We'll accept another job, but we're not going to be doing it. Can't say I'm not surprised. That wood is exactly what we need. This is a huge waste of time. I don't have time for this. So we're going to be doing something else. We're going to be building on the road. It's going to be kind of annoying, but it's going to prevent zombies from hitting the bottom. Or destroying the bottom really easily. Alrighty guys, so I'm going to speed this up here so you don't have to suffer through the building process. Now I do want to explain why I'm building my base on road and why I'm putting bars down in the middle. The reason why I'm building on the road is because the concrete is much harder than dirt. Zombies attack every block in their way including the ground, so they can tunnel right under your base within a few minutes. And if you don't have any strong blocks, they will, they will tunnel right through. Now the bars I put down act like windows. You can shoot right through them and zombies still have to break them in order to get through. That also means you can't melee through them, 
but it's a great trade-off, especially if you have automatic weapons. Now, if you're new to this game, the building process can take a while, especially early game. You have to upgrade every block manually. There are ways to make it go much faster, such as better tools. You can also make upgraded blocks in your crafting menu. However, if you do that, please be careful where you place those blocks down. Once you have upgraded or put down an upgraded block, you can't pick it back up. You have to destroy it in order to remove it, and you don't get the resources back. If you're enjoying the video, please like and subscribe. I've been enjoying uh, making videos for you guys for the past month or so. This whole YouTube experience has been fun. And so I just want to say thank you guys. Alright. Oh, I'm, I'm kind of scared, guys. I'm kind of scared. I don't have much food or anything. I have this. We might as well eat it. So we don't go hungry right off rip. Because having no stamina is exactly what we want. Oh, it's okay. It's okay. We're not... We're going to be just fine. We're going to have an escape plan. It's building blocks and running out. I don't have anywhere else to run to. That's the problem. I don't have anywhere else to run to. I can just get on top of my own base. That way, and snipe down. Is now closed. Well, I'm... Wish me luck, Trader Joel. Wish me luck. Because I'm going to need it. Oh no. Okay. Alright. Oh, Jesus. Oh. Mm-hmm. Okay. There they are. Nope. This is why it sucks to have it be elevated. Alright. So I can't- I don't know if they're just falling down. I should be able to see them. Alright, cool. Got one. That truck is actually helping me somehow. Okay, I can't see these guys. Is this not going to be as bad as I thought it's going to be? I'm literally going outside. Is this bad? I feel like this is bad. Okay. I don't know how that missed. I can always retreat in the house. Okay, of course she stopped moving. Okay, lovely, Ben. You're just so good at this game. Nice. Finish you off. Awesome. Anything good? That is perfect. That'll make my life a little easier and got some food. Okay, okay. Okay. I feel so relieved right now. We're still alive. There was only like four zombies. I have, trust me guys, I have it set to eight. The night is still young though. The night is still young. So yeah, the first night was a little bit anticlimactic. I thought there was going to be much more zombies. Um, I guess, I, I don't know if the game calculates your game stage um, or stuff like that since it's only day one. I only got like what, four zombies? But the following nights are going to be a lot more chaotic. But right now what we're doing is we're getting a little bit more wood. And I'm probably going to go to that quest over there. Because we're really running low on food and water. And get this wood here. I was expecting to be surrounded by zombies. And just murdered. Right off rip. Alright. I don't want to get too far from base. There's a sports bag here. Um, yes. Okay. So we have another ranged weapon. There's a- there, that's a deer. There's a deer here. It's Horde Knight, and there's a deer. Well. I guess it's time to 
relive like my ancestors lived. Maybe that might actually bring more zombies over here. So the reason why I, I do this, up and down like this, is because when you do that, it just plays this animation, and it's slower than just doing this. Awesome. Awesome, awesome. We got some meat out of that. Mm, guys, I'm, I'm kind of worried here. I'm gonna be honest. I don't I haven't even come across the water, not that I know of. Right. We're gonna be we're gonna we might be a little brave. We might be a little brave boys. And we might do that quest in the hopes that we can find water. This is not going to be good. Regardless if since I don't have zombies on me at all times, zombies are still gonna keep spawning. So, when a zombie runs into me, or just gives a hint that I exist, he's going to be running towards me. So, either if I come across some water just lying on the ground. Oh, that's a deer. We might we'll take that deer's life. We're going to use the rifle. Well, uh, I wonder if there's a zombie in there. Well, I'm sorry, but... The sur I need to survive. You, you don't. Maybe have a have a big brain idea. If I kill these zombies in here... Um, maybe? There's a chance they'll drop a loot bag. And I will get a better shovel at the same time. I wonder if there's a zombie in there. Still, there's a lot of zombies. That was kind of mean. A lot of free XP. Maybe. It's the Wiggly Boys! The Wiggly Boys! The wiggly boys are no more. Okay, well, we didn't get anything. There is a moldy backpack with uh, painkillers. That can be really useful. I mean, isn't it daytime, though? Wait, we'll, let's we'll wait till it's daytime before I walk in here. Because 4 a.m. is daytime, right? It sure is. Okay. We're, we're good. We're allowed to be in here. Now it's not like nothing ever happened. It's back to normal. That's perfectly working. Really, guys? That's a working... It's not an... I can't even search that. Okay. It'd be nice if there's water in here. There's not. Okay. That's locked. Wait, please. I need water. I need something. None of this is searchable. Alright, we need water, boys. Yeah, I won't recommend drinking gasoline. Well. We will put the skill in... Wait, Master Chef is still in strength. Why? And, uh, more of that. Okay. Ow. Did not like that. That you hit me like that, zombie. Okay, this could be good. We can get some water here. The Spiker Zombie is actually going to be a pain. Really? Really? Oh, now I'm hungry. And this Spiker Zombie is still alive. He, he, 
Eat this. This is where I need, right here. Cool beans, we got it. All right, but what's most important is this stuff. We need it. Please have water, and I need food now too. Please have water, okay, that's fine. Use. It's not gonna get me undehydrated. Because this game doesn't make any sense when it comes to that, but. We actually might not be dehydrated anymore after this. I need to be careful with those Molotovs. Alright. Cool, cool. Let's head back to base. Alright, oh, I want the stones though. My stones! Mine! Okay. Raw meat, bone, land claim. Oh, I do have murky water. We'll drink this in case of emergency. Okay, he's now open, guys. Alright. Oh, it's hot outside. Hey! Wipe that smirk off your face. Doing one job doesn't make us pals. Got okay. it. Okay, well, this guy is not very nice, clearly. Um, we'll take the 9mm ammo. I see your inventory. Does he have a cooking pot? He does, he does. We're merely buying it. So we can boil that murky water. Um. So I assume. Food. He has a bunch of food. That we might be buying. What else does he have? He has some ammo that's not worth it. Um, T-shirt that's not worth it. I hear something walking out there. He does have jars of honey. Shit, man! I treat you that good, and I hear you something don't walking. even fucking tip me. Dude, I hate this guy. Um, that's so far, man. Let's get one. That's so far. Alrighty, guys. So I pretty much spend the entirety of day two just upgrading and fortifying my base even more. Alright, guys. It's, it's getting there. It's getting there. Here's what our base looks like. I know. Pretty cool, right? Believe me, depending on how much you see, I, this took me all day. Like in game day, this took me all day. I did little, literally nothing but harvest trees. If we survive this, we're just gonna do some repairs. And tomorrow we're gonna be focusing on questing and getting supplies. Oh, it's about to start. All right, it's horde night. Oh, there's a lot more zombies already. Oh my god, there's a lot more zombies already. We're going to be fine. We're going to be fine. Okay. I can't tell where some of these zombies are at. One spikes have been killing them at least. Bad news is I'm not getting XP for him. Arrows, I need arrows. As many arrows as we can. Okay. That's so sad. That's so sad. Okay, how am I missing point blank? What is this, dude? One's dead. Okay. This is why we have that. It might be, looks like the rest of it here, maybe? Nope, there's some more over there. I don't like how that zombie's on top of you. Did they change the zombie AI? 
Like, they're more focused on me and not, like, the weak points of the houses, which is the door, by the way. How is that missing point blank? Please, zombie. Okay, that block up there doesn't look very good. Okay, it's getting hit somewhere else. We can hurry up. Deal with these guys. Okay. Where is it getting hit at? Everywhere? Cool. I can't imagine what the rest of the house looks like if this part is getting... What? Was it the door now? It's the door. Something broke. Okay. Please die. Please die. Okay. If they break in, it's not a huge deal. We have the other house to fall back into. That's why we had this other wall. Okay. I can't hit that. We haven't got like any loot drops so far, which is kind of like really depressing. Why are you still alive? You're no longer still alive, and I didn't get any XP for that. No loot drops at all? Really? The entire night, not a single loot drop. Alright, well, some things got destroyed, but I think the, the worst is over. They really attacked one side. I almost just ran into my spike. So we survived another night. We're going to real quick repair some of these blocks, and then we're going to get ready and set off to do the next quest there. Um, time is very valuable, as you saw. That Horde Knight was a lot more... Difficult. <laughs> a lot more difficult, so I can't imagine what the next ones are. Come on. I won't be able to hit you. Nope. I was not able to hit you. A better shovel, I will take it. What is in here? I will take it. Perfect. Perfect. But he's dead. I was about to say, I was about to say, calm down, zombies, calm down. That's a zombie. Alright, cool. Say, how am I supposed to get down there? I like how I don't use spears at all. Please, please tell me there's not even food in here. That's good, though. That's good. Help me cut down trees. Wait, 632 damage. I'm sorry, what? Um, can I make an axe? S okay. <laughs> um, um, okay, it's fixed itself. I was about to say, okay, well, um, really? Well, this sucks. There's no food in here. Oh, there's a beaker, though.
Now we finished the quest here, however I am running very low on food and water so I'm kind of desperate for anything at the moment. Is that a well? Is that a well? Is that a well? Is there water in here? Please tell me there's water in here. No. Oh, yes. Yes, dude. Uh, dude. We're going to take this. Take some vitamins. Our water problems should be like no more now. Come on. Just drink the water. Come on. You can drink drink the water. You, you're supposed to be able to drink the water. You need drink the water. So for some context, the new Alpha 21 update uh, al allows you to drink water if you have a free hand and you just find water on the ground. You're supposed to be able to drink from it, but I guess here you, you, you just can't. I guess some water sources you, you can't drink water from. Which is uh, very uh, unfortunate for me at this moment. Just drink the water, my guy. Please. <laughs> drink it. Drink the water. Please, game. You can't breathe because you're submerged in water. Now there's a zombie. Look what you've done, game. Look what you've done. So soon I realized that I just have to give up on this and <laughs> I just can't drink the water. So we're gonna head back to the trader here. Yeah, ignore that. Just, just ignore that completely. That never happened. Never happened. Well, damn, you smell like the dead. You better have money. Gordon. Oh my god, why are they all buried supplies? I mean, they're food related, but okay. I don't like you. What are you standing there for? Don't you have work to do? You need to be quiet. Water. 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 No, I need it. You so with the water acquired, we're actually going to go ahead and do these buried treasure chests uh, quest. It's going to help us with food and stuff like that. And it's it kind of sucks because we won't be able to actually go into any POIs and loot that stuff. But we will get a lot of food instead. And it's not going to be that bad because our our mining skill is pretty high. And I already found it. Gonna deal with the zombies that spawn. We're actually gonna fight these guys instead of run away. I'm fighting these guys for XP in the hopes of getting a loot bag. Not gonna happen by the looks of it. What? At least wipe that shit off your boots before you come into my shop. This dude is just really annoying. Um, do that. Do you have jobs? Bad supplies. Work. It's a deal. All right. More food. Anything good? This is exactly what I've been wanting. Cornbread and golden tea. You're pretty smart now, don't you? Armor pocket mod, that's probably the best thing out of all of this. I can get ammo for the gun I totally have. Um the armor pocket mod. The wood could have been the wood could have been good there too. Anything good? Not really. Oh no, there's the zombies. The scary zombies. Alright, cool. We have returned. Now at least wipe that shit off your boots before you come into my shop. This guy's annoying. 
Nope, we have one more to do. It's gonna be this one. It's a deal. Oh, fruit stash. Oh, I can make grilled meat now. Yes, dude. It's actually really not really useful. So I don't have to waste that meat. Time to get insulted again. Or threatened. So. Man, do you have some AC? It's hot in here. We got ourselves a real life hero, and now he wants to be paid. Okay, so we did it. Here is my thought process on this. We're a hundred percent going with the bicycle, okay? But it would not be bad either if we went for the water filter, but obviously the bicycle. But yeah. Why are you serious? What do you mean, dude? That's so far. Literally, that's all we're gonna be doing tomorrow. I've got work. If yes. good luck, you better not make me regret this. Yeah, please be quiet. You're annoying me. At least he ch he changes his stock tomorrow, so maybe he would have something better. Alrighty, guys. It's been a little bit. It's almost that time. For horror for the horde and so what i've done is i've built myself a, li a little ceiling for my main little square there and i'm going to be shooting from the tops i'm also going to be throwing some molotovs down uh, molotovs don't actually deal damage to your blocks uh, but it does a bunch of damage to zombies so let's see how this goes oh it's that time guys let's see if we got this they had to come in from the front look at these guys They should be dying soon. Here they are. Nice sloop bag. Okay, it's raining now. Rain doesn't matter. There they come, boys. Trying to get a little closer. Yes, perfect. Run into the fire. Burn. Burn. There's still some more just hanging about. Okay. They're definitely not liking. They're focusing on something over there. I need to be careful. What? Yeah, let's repair it. Let's move it. Get back up. Okay, there's still some... Some fools still trying to break in. I think, I think this might be all of them, guys. So we're gonna actually go down and beat him up. Now. This is all. I hear some stuff. Nope, no, 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 no. There's still more. They just switched sides on us. They're over here now. They're trying to trick us. This is a this is a waste on you. Okay. Where's left? Okay, there's more of you guys coming this way. Alright. Just kinda let them just show up. No, why did that happen? Move please. That was not good. I don't even think I- oh, there you go. So much stuff is breaking, I don't even know what, what is. I think it's just... Okay. Okay. 
wieder ein. It's almost like these spike traps are actually killing them. Normally they don't. Are we done? Are we done? Or do I think we did it? Let's see what we let's loot the spoils real quick. Perfect. That's exactly what I want. It's not, by the way, but ah, uh, perfect. That was like nothing. <laughs> um. So I guess we have a choice at this point to go to the, the trader now. I don't know if that's going to be a good idea, but I think I'm going to take that risk. So we slowly make our way to the next trader, and unfortunately for me, it is in this huge town. Now, if you don't know, um, the game likes to chug when it's in towns like this, so I'm sorry if uh, the game looks a little choppy. That's not because of the recording, it's because at this point, um, the game doesn't like being like you being in towns and stuff like that. Awesome, awesome, scrap you. Some big houses. What is that house behind here? That just. Oh, there's a police officer zombie. Nope, 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 nope. And now, now it's daytime and now zombies are spawning. Is this a new. apartment? Hotel thing? That's crazy, man. Maybe we should do a survival and just in here. See how long we can survive. So this is Trader Hugh. I'm pretty sure. I want to be able to make these blocks. Or like this. Like this would be so cool. Oh no, it's Trader Joel. It's actually tra Trader Joel. You have to wait. Until he's open. Hey, we got here kind of just in time. But we're gonna look at, we're gonna search for some cars and destroy some of the embers. That actually makes sense, because it's actual Trader Joel. Alright. It's my first time I've seen Trader Joel's, uh, area. How goes it? Oh, okay. Friend. Yeah, he only has tier one. That sucks. Let me see your inventory. He has no weapons. Is he armor? Is that what he is? Might be armor. Hopefully... The trader that is by our house... Uh, trader Wrecked is, has better stuff in his inventory because it should have restocked. And hopefully he has quests that are right next to him and not four kilometers away. Because that's probably a, a good possibility of happening. So as we head back to go see our old trader pal, we come across a police car. Now these cars are new to this update, and so, as you can see, it's locked. So I'm like, okay, let's see if I hit them and they unlock. This is what happens. Before. Is this, is this gonna blow up? Or is, this, is this gonna be the end of the game for us? Okay. This is new. This is new. Well, please be quiet. Okay. Peace. Oh my gosh. Okay. This is good. This is great. This is really good, guys. We actually have ammo and a gun that's somewhat decent. I mean, it's okay, but you know. So as you saw, we managed to break into the car and we actually got some pretty cool stuff. And so I thought, I thought maybe we should look for more police cars since that really wasn't an issue. And it was pretty easy to deal with. Oh, another police car. Unless, no, this has to be the same one. This is the same one. No, it's not. 
Alright, it's gonna get jammed again. It's gonna be all this whole shebang. <laughs> oh my god. The zombies just spawned. Okay. That's a feral zombie. It blew up? Oh god, this is this is this is not what I intended for it to happen. Now I know. Now I know. Now I know. This is bad. This is bad. Is this this is the enemy? Am I dead here? I'm dead. Oh my god. Okay. Um so I guess this is the end of the end of this run. We'll spawn on my bed. We'll 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 see. Okay, I we'll see. Look at our stats here. We had 131 or 31. I'm so stupid. 133 zombie kills. Longest life three hours and 31 minutes. So, yeah. That's the end of this run. That's kind of lame. That was honestly kind of lame. Alrighty guys, so now I know... Now I know what happens when uh, you break a police car. It can blow up. I'm pretty sure it blew up because the police officer zombie shot and I guess it did enough damage to blow it up. But this is the end of this video and the end of this run. My intention was just to have one life. Unfortunately, I did not die from the horde. But if you guys want to keep seeing videos like this, please like and subscribe, and I might do this again fairly soon. I did have fun playing it, and I hope you guys really enjoyed the video. Thanks, guys.